It's a chicken salad. Where is it from? Sierra's Kitchen. Superior. or welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're gonna be recreating some TikTok viral recipes, like stuff that you see all over your For You page. We're gonna try it, see if it's actually good. So last night, I spent so much time researching what I needed for these recipes. I put together a whole cart on my Walmart app, cause I do like grocery delivery, cause sometimes you just don't wanna go in Walmart. And tell me why, they had pretty much everything but the bread. So I ran down the street after the gym and I went and got some bread from this bread store because I didn't feel like going all the way to Walmart because that would defeat the whole purpose of getting my order delivered. So I went to this bread store, got my bread, but then I found out that the grocery delivery was already on its way. And I didn't want to pull up at the same time as the grocery delivery because that would just be awkward. could have got your own grocery. I mean, I tipped of course, but you know, that just would have been kind of awkward. So I decided to go somewhere else and get a few more groceries that I already needed and tell me why. When I was getting back into the car I hit my head on my freaking top of my car because I'm tall and I was trying to get in the car and, and, and boom I hit my head <sighs> and now I have the world's worst headache so if you see me acting it's because I'm a but also it's because I have a headache and I was super excited for this video I did not want to have a headache right now miniature grocery haul chicken butter heavy whipping cream ground beef green cheese a single onion coffee Anybody got a clue what I'm making? Tomato sauce. Baby tomatoes. Parmesan cheese. Turkey bacon. The bread that I had to leave my house to go get. Chocolate muffins are not for me. Kevin made me get them since I was going to the bakery. He was like, get something sweet. Bell pepper. Cream mix. This is the stuff that I got that I just needed. Boneless ribs. Chicken breast. Kevin, some pizza bagels. Because he eats like a five-year-old. Seasoning blend. I reused these as trash bags. Oh, also balsamic vinegar. LaCroix. Banana pepper. Black olives. I just spilled my water everywhere. It's so much water. You know, I'm just not gonna let it ruin my day. I'm gonna take that as the sign that I needed to mop my floor. Now I just gotta put all of this stuff up. viral TikTok egg sandwich where the eggs are at the bottom of the skillet and then you flip it and I'm using turkey bacon but with my turkey bacon I actually cut it straight down the middle and that gives you like the perfect size for a sandwich I don't keep mine whole because I just feel like it's pointless and I cook mine in the air fryer I'm all about my air fryer but I'm not gonna lie to y'all I did have to just go and wash this because I forgot that I had to use the air fryer for this video and my air fryer stays dirty that's the main thing that I cook with I tell you every time I am a bare minimum queen You're supposed to let it cook a little bit longer. I like mine toasty. I don't like them too burnt. Like that. That's good. Absolutely no promises, but I'm going to try to clean up as I go on this challenge. Ow! Ah! Time to taste it and see if it's actually good. Now, obviously you can add whatever you want to this. I think it would have been really good with some avocado. I wasn't thinking about that. I should have got some avocado. It's so cheesy. It looks so good. Mmm, this is good. Now, obviously this is just a regular old breakfast sandwich. I don't think there's much too special about it. I do like the fact that you can make the eggs and the bread and all of that in the same pan. Cause I remember as a kid when we would have egg sandwiches, you'd have to make, you know, the eggs first or whatever. Then you'd toast everyone's bread and add the eggs as you go or whatever. This is a really cool hack just to like make it all in one skillet. So I think it's really convenient. Now, as you could tell when I was doing the hack, it didn't work out exactly how it was supposed to work out. I don't know, those people on TikTok make it look 
looks so easy and it's not really that easy. So I would say if you're making a breakfast sandwich, definitely try this hack. My bread was like kind of splitting from the egg so it kind of wasn't together, but it is easy. It makes making a breakfast sandwich easy. If you do this, please add avocado and tell me how it tastes. But yeah, I think my eggs came out pretty good. I mean, they're not too overcooked or rubbery. They're a little rubbery, I'm not gonna lie. But yeah, they're really good. One thing I will say, the bread came out the perfect amount of toasted, perfect. So yeah, try this hack for the heck of it. I mean, start making your sandwiches like this. It's, it's a good hack when it wants to cooperate. ice everywhere. So I don't know if you guys can tell by this lineup of items, but we're having the TikTok viral healthy Coke. Pretty much you just use a sparkling water. This one is actually flavored with strawberry, but you take a sparkling water and you take balsamic vinegar and you put it over ice and it's supposed to taste similar to a Coke, but healthy. I'm not sure about that. Pretty much everyone on TikTok hated it. So I don't know how it was such a big trend, but I've always wanted to try it. This is so hard to get open. There we go. Fun fact, I have never in my life had balsamic vinegar or LaCroix. So this is gonna be interesting. I have absolutely no clue what I'm getting myself into. I have absolutely no clue in the world how this is gonna taste. Oh, when they said vinegar, I didn't know that they meant actual vinegar. Like, I don't know what balsamic vinegar is. I've literally never had it. I see people online say like, oh, I put too much. So I guess you, I guess you just put like a little splash. I hope that's not too much. Okay, we're just gonna do it. It smells absolutely disgusting. Okay, at least the LaCroix is strawberry because I smell the strawberry. So hopefully it will save us. It actually smells kind of good now with the strawberry. Maybe this won't be too bad. On TikTok, they actually make it look kind of good when they're like putting the straw in it and they go like, like it looks good when they're mixing it on TikTok. I'm actually scared. It smells really good. What if I actually like it? Am I weird if I actually like this? I will be shocked if I actually like this. If I like this, I owe all of you guys $10. No, I'm just kidding. Even if I paid all of you guys $1, I couldn't do that. I'd be broke. There's so many of you guys. I'm just talking to like distract you guys because I really don't want to try this. Moment of truth. The strawberry, Coke where? How is this like a Coke? I mean, I guess I, s mm -mm. it tastes like beer in my opinion. Let me try this. Ugh, that's disgusting. It needs some sugar. I'm so glad I'm trying this with strawberry because if it was just plain sparkling water, it'd be absolutely disgusting. It's honestly not too bad over ice with this compared to just how this tastes by itself. I think the vinegar actually saved it a little bit. I don't know how. It tastes good at first and then the aftertaste is just disgusting. Yeah, no. Uh -uh. On that note, it's lunchtime. Guess what we're making? This is probably the most viral of all the meals. You know what I'm doing? It's a chicken salad. 81st <laughs> Deli Superior. She says a little bit of what is in the ingredients on the video. Chicken, pickles, banana peppers, bell peppers, tomatoes, onions. But I looked it up just to get a little bit more clarification. And I saw a couple reviews from other people and they told most of the ingredients that were in it. So I'm gonna go based on that. Here's what I have in my notes. Chicken, pickles, banana peppers, bell peppers, tomatoes, onions, black olives, eggs, spring mix. So I had a meeting that I completely forgot about. It's about 45 minutes since I took all of this stuff out. I did go ahead and put my chicken in the air fryer before I did the meeting. So the chicken is done. I just really have to chop up all of these vegetables and then boil the eggs. salad very chopped. 
My house is gonna smell like onions for so long. This is definitely way too much onion. My eyes are burning, but I don't wanna wipe them and get more onion in them. I don't even like raw onion. I usually have to have my onion cooked. Just digging my hand in the pickle jar. I mean, I'm the only one who eats them, so. Try a pickle on a barbecue pork salad, and it's so good. I don't think I've ever had pickles on a chicken salad, though. Don't judge how I chop. I got another cutting board for my lettuce because I didn't want it to be mixed with all the toppings because I'm not going to use all of those toppings. Now someone made a video and they said that they had spring mix on the chicken salad and I'm not a huge fan of spring mix to be honest. I don't like how big it is so I'm going to try to like chop it up some more. I'm trying not to cut myself but obviously I'm not a professional at cutting vegetables. I'm just trying to get out of this without cutting myself. I love you guys but I don't think I I love you guys enough to be hurting myself for videos. See, now that is better. This is gonna be a chopped chicken salad. I do need more lettuce in that though. But I think that's enough lettuce because I'm still kind of full from that sandwich because I had kind of a late breakfast. Now we're gonna load her. Pickles, just a little bit of onion. Banana peppers, bell peppers, tomato, more tomato. Now we're gonna chop up our chicken thighs. They look good and seasoned. Himalayan salt. I definitely need some salt for these veggies and the egg. It's a chicken salad. Where is it from? Sierra's Kitchen. Superior. Now y'all gonna be mad at me for this part and look, I forgot to get the ingredients for the homemade ranch dressing because apparently that's what they use in the chicken salad. They use like a homemade ranch dressing. So we're just gonna use what I have at home which is obviously Hidden Valley. I do light Hidden Valley. I mean, I don't do light ranch because I like a lot of ranch. I know it would be so much better with a homemade ranch dressing and I was gonna do it too. I just forgot to get the ingredients because I was gonna look up a recipe. But let's taste. I'm gonna mix it all together so we get a little bit of everything. This looks so good. This truly looks amazing. Truly superior. Kevin just came in. I told y'all it was a late lunch. You wanna try my chicken salad? It's from 81st Deli. 81st Deli went way to Ohio to get it. Ohio. <laughs> Taste it. You like it? Pretty good. Really? You want some? You can have half. You don't even like salads. I know, but damn. You think it's good? Get, get a bowl. I get one bite with the egg. And the tomatoes and the bell pepper. Ugh. I forgot to add cheese. I just realized. Do they have cheese on that one? I think so. I don't remember. Honestly, it's good without the cheese. Dang! You hungry, honey? Mm -hmm. I told you salads are good. You be tripping. It's really fresh with all the vegetables. Want some more? I, one more. I was telling y'all I don't really like spring mix, but it's good in this. I like it because it's more chopped up. This is a good salad for real. We don't talk about bro. No, 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 no. You have to sing it. I don't know the lyrics. We don't talk about Bruno. My hair though. You can't say that? You can't say we don't talk about Bruno? You can't say that? No. You're mean. I don't know. I got a buddy out of ya. We don't talk about Bruno. So this one I may have to keep checking the recipe for, but it is the million dollar spaghetti. It's kind of like an Alfredo mixed with spaghetti, also mixed with lasagna. But first thing I'm gonna do is preheat my oven because I'm gonna get that out of the way. Now I'm gonna cook up some ground beef.
my dinner right here, yo. Well, I burnt my finger when I was cooking and now it hurts. Is it we gotta taste it together. You ready? Mmm. That's good. This is it. And it doesn't even have rice. <laughs> Everything he eats, he has to have rice with it. Mm. What would you rate it? Let's put it eight. Sit. Yeah, how about you? Like a 9.5. Really? It's really good. It's one of the best spaghetti I've tasted, but I'm not a big fan of spaghetti anyway, so. Yeah. Okay, we can go sit down now. I guess we were so busy eating our food. Let's try this again. I do not want that music to play. I guess we were so busy eating that we just forgot to film an outro. But the food was really good, so you guys should try that spaghetti. There was one meal that I didn't get to make. Well, it was a snack because I was so full. Like, I could not eat any more food. But if you guys want to see another one of these, just let me know. Comment the recipes that you want me to recreate down below. Comment down below if you've tried these things. Let me know if you like them. And link some TikToks down below of your favorite recipes, and I'll recreate them. Thanks. Love you guys. Bye.